Scrope. Who is Scrope? Off on another adventure, are we? Revelio. Levioso, Akio. Pumpkins. Ah, I think I know just the place. Revelio. Revelio. Down to the water's edge. Hmm, this had better not be a trick. Rebellion. Akio. Revelio. Akio. Levioso. Incendio. Revelio. Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mention the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. 
Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honour her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help, but when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. How did you know that I'd found a book and that it's missing pages? Scrope and the other house elves are good at staying out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. How did you injure your ear? The Blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. One day, dear Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. Tell me more about this treasured ring. It's adorned with the Black family crest. The headmaster would be pleased with Scrope for returning it. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast and place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Scrope will wait right here for you. Best of luck finding your pages. Incendio. I should investigate. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Revelio. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Revelio. Rebellio. Incendio. Rebellion. 
Revelio. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. Visitor? Oh! Ah! Ooh! <laughs> ah! The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happens next. Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest and I'll show you where to find the pages. Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. 
He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor, whatever's sure to cause the most chaos. He dropped them after a particularly aggressive romp through the library. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Revelio. doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Rebellion. Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the head. Well, Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. I've always said that travel broadens the mind.
Revelio. I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. He's here if you wish to stay in practice. Expelliarmus! You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Expelliarmus! Levioso! Akio! Expelliarmus! Still at it, I see. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although. We got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigella's flag for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Time itself? I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. An unspeakable? What does... Ah! As you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Expelliarmus! How nice to see you, my young friend. Revelio. Living in dormitories. No parents around, man. Revelio. Revelio.
Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased. Lumos. Revelio. I know a Merlin trial when I see one. That's that. Settled. And where did I set my traps? Was it lower or upper? Plans must be carefully and strategically <laughs> laid out. Haste is a false chariot. I shall not allow the very life of me to be held ransom at the mercy of recklessness. Perhaps I'll scout around Felcroft for something to poach. Perhaps I shall scout around Felcroft for something to poach. He's dead. Be a beast. The beast of Elio.
Revelio. 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 as a troll. Go there! Get off! You the relief, Treadwell. Let me also. Don't wait to take a hit, are you? Protego. One less poacher in the world. Revelio. 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 This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revelio.
Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Surprisingly, as good as his word. Revelio. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. 
There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. Incendio! Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Yeah. But, ah! Now, let's see where Jack Doris led me. I wonder how big this place is. They lit for long. Revelio. I need to light all three before they time out on me. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. I wonder if any of my spells will put me through this. Accurate! Expel the armors! Protego! Stupid! Incendio! Expelliarms. I'm not going to touch those. Look, Accio, Infratego, Stupid, Incendio. Expelliarmus! Incendio! Stupefy! Levioso! Protego! Stupefy! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Levioso! Stupefy! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Stupefy! Akio! Protego! Revelio!
Revelio. If I could summon that platform to me, I could likely get on it. Levioso. Incendio. Protego. Expelliarmus. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Revelio. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Akio. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Revelio. An untouched chest. Tarotor wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Akio. <laughs> Incendio. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Revelio. Incendio. I'm 
glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Touched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. I thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this one, but there's no sign of him. Accio! skeleton in sight. help myself to this. Accio. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? It's almost complete. More spiders. This can't be a bad with the gang. Let me answer. Accio. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Predator. Stupid one. Expelliarmus. Stupid one. Incendio! Spelling arms! Stupid one! Levioso! Potato! 
Incendio. Expelliarmus. Levioso. Incendio. Potato. Stupid time. Expelliarmus. Stupid time. Levioso. Multiplied since Jackdaw came this way. Revelio. Incendio. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. I must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains and those pages. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is, the map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm, is there something beyond this room? Incendio. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Protego. Stupefy. Levioso. Accio. Stupefy. Accio. Incendio. Levioso. Expelliarmus would have so many bones. Protego. Stupefy. Incendio. Starting to flood. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What 
is this place? Can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention, and... Might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss, but first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm, that is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place.